Hey, it's Megan from Say Hello Mama, and I am so excited to share with you the bag that has been saving my bum during our move with our three kids across the country. This is the Ella Dane diaper bag. This is in the caramel color. It's a beautiful, not quite camel, not quite brandy. I'm loving that it's in the between those two colors. Gorgeous faux leather. It has gold hardware and a super fun tassel, which I love. But let's start with an overview of some of those exterior things we have going on, because it's awesome. Tons of pockets on the outside, which is my saving grace at the moment because everybody wants me to hold their water bottles and all of their junk and they keep handing it to me. So all these pockets are really, really helpful. So the first thing you'll notice is hello, grab handle. Awesome, awesome grab handle. It's right here on the top of the bag. I love how when it's like when it's engaged, that's a dumb way of saying that. When I'm using the grab handle, the bag isn't like falling over in any way. Like it just like really naturally holds itself. I don't know, that's kind of a silly thing to think about, but I've seen other bags like the grab handle that just doesn't look as natural and this one really does. I have been living with this bag in backpack mode. Obviously three kids, lots of Home Depot trips because we're renovating our house at the moment and I just do not have the hands for everybody if I am carrying like a bag over my shoulder. So the backpack style is crazy comfortable. I know you guys will ask, so I'll just say that this is the most comfortable faux leather backpack I have used by far. This is super, super comfortable. Okay, one thing about these backpack straps you have got to know is that unclip them and tuck them into this back pocket here. So if you want to use a messenger strap, you can, and you don't even have to have these jangling around at you, which is awesome. And on the back here is an awesome magnetic slip pocket. I freaking love slip pockets on bags because I'm always needing just like throw wrappers or junk or, you know, books, something in there that's helpful. In the back here is the change pad that comes with the bag. Now, I'm not afraid to say, this is my favorite change pad that I've ever had come with a bag. I know, I've tried a lot. This one, it has like a great wristlet strap. It's good size and it has an awesome pocket on here. So I have put my wipes in this side and my diapers in this side and handed it to my husband at church so he could go change the baby. And he was so appreciative, kind of. He was appreciative as a man can get that the wipes and the diapers and the change pad weren't all being handed to him separately, but that they were like all together. So when he came back, he just handed it to me and he didn't have to worry that he'd lost everything while he was changing the baby. Okay, so I just took that out of this back slip pocket. I should say too, it is magnetic. Freaking awesome. The closure is like in the bag, so you don't have to worry about like snaps getting aligned. So it just works perfectly every single time. Here on the side of the bag is this super unique pocket. It is pretty deep, like my hand fits inside of it. It also fits an iPhone perfectly in there and makes it really convenient so you don't lose it. You can see this is the side with the D-ring, this D-ring on it, which is for this tassel, which is completely removable right there. This D-ring and this one across here are where your messenger strap would go if you want to use the bag that way, and it does come with that strap. I have it right here. This is the messenger strap it comes with, so it would fit there and there and go across your body that way. Okay, let's talk about this. This beautiful bottle pocket. There are two of them, one on each side, and it drives me bonkers when a bag has a bottle pocket that doesn't fit a bottle or outside pockets that are usable. So I have, this is my saving grace, 32 ounce hydro flask and it fits in the side pocket no problem it is probably the largest one that could fit here but it is freaking awesome okay at this point i showed you like the majority of what's going on over here so i want to get into the packing portion of this video so i'm going to tip the camera down and show you what i have inside the rest of the pockets let's start with these awesome front magnetic pockets so these ones the magnet is on the outside like a snap enclosure but they work super super well and they're nice and strong and just a really perfect size. So in this one, I'm keeping my iPhone 10, um, and that fits just fine in there, standing up, and it closes and everything. And in this one, I have the shoulder clips that came at the back. I haven't opened them yet because my shoulder is on the truck. So let's open them. Okay, these are awesome. They have the same gold hardware that's on the back, and then they're just the Velcro kind, so that'll just fit over any kind of handlebar. And so you get two of those, which came at the bag, which is so handy. And in this zip pocket here, which by the way, can we take a second to appreciate how nondescript this logo is? It's nice and embossed. You can feel it when you run your fingers over it. And it's just really, really clean and doesn't like overly make a statement, but it's just a really nice looking logo. And in here, this is where I keep my wallet, a full size wallet, and apparently a Chips Ahoy thing and a receipt. I just went to Target. The Chips Ahoy were just to survive with the three kids. And so this pocket's actually huge. Like I could fit 
I could fit more in here if I needed to, like my whole hand fits. Just really, really awesome. Okay, on to the main section. Okay, so the kids had Chips Ahoy. I have tried these, do not try these. They will become your favorite and you'll be addicted and you will have no one but to blame but me. So yeah, that's my plug for this. Okay, you can see I have this bag like maybe half full and it's holding everything I need for my three. So the inside lining is super, super wipeable. It's like a nylon. And in here, there's a really long key leash. Um, if a key leash isn't long, I don't know why you would ever put it in a bag. So this one to me is awesome. Um, it's a lobster clasp, um, which I really like those better than like the ones with the teeny tiny, I don't know, little lever thing on it. So that's a major win. And I saw this cool trick um, from Mama D Reviews and she took this and she you put it in the pocket over here and that way you could like leave it outside of your bag and still zip it up which also I want to talk about the double zipper on this bag hello I love me a good double zipper and a long key leash and bottle pockets and I'm not afraid to show it okay onward so there are two pockets here they are like an elasticized pocket so in one I have size three diapers in one I have size five diapers yes I am trying to get my daughter potty trained I swear it's gonna happen for me eventually then I have like this middle section here and a large mesh compartment at the back and then here I just have a pouch for all my mom stuff gosh I have a lot back here I have hand wipes these are now our favorite my kids say they smell like Mickey Mouse so there you go they smell like Mickey Mouse they do smell like Mickey Mouse he says I also have just Pampers wipes I have a blanket for my little boy I have some breath mints there at the bottom and a rattle okay another great thing to love about this bag interior zip pocket what do I have in here gosh I have pacifiers for both my kids for both my little kids I should say I have boogie wipes and I have a bag of band-aids because oh my gosh four-year-old boys and that pocket is huge and easy to get to, everything I love. Okay, in this middle compartment here, I have a snack pouch. In this larger pouch, I have changes of clothes for my two-year-old and my baby, and that fits in there great. You have all of this awesome internal organization, and then you have two more. So you have this um, interior, gosh, can I get you a view on that? Interior elasticized bottle pocket. I keep my sunglasses in there most of the time, but right now I just have baby powder. And last but not least is this super unique, never seen anything like it, pocket. It is like a flat pocket, it has a zipper, but it folds with the bag if you need it to. Um, this is an insulated pocket. Right now, this super secret pocket holds my most beloved item, my Tylenol. I've been getting crazy stress headaches because of the move, and so I just keep that on me, and it zips, and the kids, if they ever got into my diaper bag, <laughs> what am I saying, ever? When they always get into my diaper bag, they would never even notice this pocket, so I don't have to worry about them getting into medication they shouldn't be. Anyway, that's a long-winded way of saying this pocket rocks. This bag is more lightweight than a lot, a lot of diaper bags I have tried, and that seems counterintuitive because you've got a lot going on. You've got pockets, you've got hardware, you have backpack straps and the grab handle, all that stuff, but I'm telling you, this bag, like, when I hold it, it doesn't feel really, really heavy in any way. So in the category of faux leather, I think this one's the lightest. Hey y'all, thank you so much for watching. I am so excited about this diaper bag. I am telling you, this is my favorite faux leather diaper bag um, I have used. I think the quality is above that of other bags I've tried in a similar fabric. Um, I love the double zipper, I love the bottle pockets, the grab handle, the backpack. Because the shape of the bag is just really, really comfortable, so that's just ideal for me right now. This color is gorgeous. I love how it's an in-between the brandy and the camel. Kind of like not too dark, not too light. It's really just really lovely. So if you are wanting to shop this bag, which I'm sure you are, I will have the link in the description box below. Um, you can also follow them on Instagram and follow me on Instagram. I am Megan Kingsford over there. That's my name. Um, but I think if you search Say Hello Mama, it should come up as well that way. If not, the link is in the description box below. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Um, I'm planning to have some house videos and things like that coming up soon. Just a matter of getting my life back together and this hair, which is dying in the Texas humidity, figured out. <laughs> Please don't forget to hit subscribe if you aren't already, and if you are already subscribed, I can't thank you enough for watching these videos and sticking around with me. Um, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!